I've actually never seen a single video of anyone doing this to a Fortec. Rear wheel drive swapping. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, I have actually never seen anybody do that on a Fortec. Probably because, you know, it, will, it probably will spin out, which, yeah, probably that will happen. Did I get that tire wrong? Yeah, I got this front tire wrong. So I'll fix that later. Well, anyways, as you can see, it's a two-wheel drive converted Fortec 2.0. Um, so I know you guys are going to be thinking, like, that is ridiculous on what you're doing. Why would you do that? I mean, hey, it's just for the hell of it. I mean, it's my it's my little car, anyways. And besides, the real Ford GT is rear-wheel drive, and so is the Mustang. So I'm like, you know what? Let me give this a shot. I've actually done this exact same thing with a Helion Animus 18SC, 18TR, where I... Uh, Took the uh, the front dog bones out on the front, you know, all of that stuff to make it two wheel drive. So basically, what I just did on the Fortec, uh, compared to my Animus, the Animus I have to like take off the front differential housings and uh, and remove the little shaft cups that goes there. But in this case, on the Traxxas Fortec, I didn't have to do that. All I just need to do is. Remove this, uh, tilt the caster block uh, a little bit, and just remove the, remove these dog bones out, and it's easy. And yeah, so now my Fortec is rear wheel drive. So yeah, I just did this just for the hell of it, because I've never seen anyone do this on YouTube, any any Fortec owner. Um, doing this on YouTube so um, I guess this is the first hmm. anyways guys uh, that's just a little update on the Fortec I just gotta see how well it actually handles it being two-wheel drive I know some people are saying it's not gonna handle well well I'm not gonna take your word for it until I actually drive it so yeah